Do you want to explore how you can create your own games from scratch? So build your own online games using JavaScript, learn more about game design and the steps in order to create fully functional games from start to finish? Well, this course has it all. It's got five amazing projects that you can build quickly and easily. You won't find this anywhere else. All the code is unique and built from scratch, step by step, how to build these fun, interactive, dynamic games Source code is also included, so you can try the code out for yourself, create your own version of these games. So the first amazing game that we're going to be building is going to be the JavaScript word scramble. So we're going to scramble the letters of words, and it's up to the player to solve the word as quickly as possible with as little wrong guesses as possible. This section is going to include how to add scoring, how to load dynamic word lists, how to create an interactive JavaScript game interfaces and interactions for the player all from scratch. And then we've got some bonus content, how you can load your word lists from a Google Sheet so that you can update the content in the Google Sheet and it will update the game without having to update the application coding from the game. So dri driving dynamic content into a JavaScript game. Next up is the JavaScript game word decoder. So every letter has a number associated with it. The player needs to solve the phrase using the numbers, letters, and codes. All the words and phrases are also dynamically loaded. So this provides flexibility within the gameplay. We're gonna be including how to set up the game board, how to create the player interaction, how to score the game, and then also how to improve some of the code, how to tweak, debug it, and final improvements of the code in order to make a fully functional game from scratch. Next up is JavaScript Hangman. So this is where the player comes in and they have to solve the phrase. They've got presented with all the letters of the alphabet and they need to guess those letters with making as little misses as possible and solve the puzzle. So solve those hidden words. We've also got some new game elements that you can introduce. So looking for the DOM content loaded. So this runs the application as soon as the DOM content is loaded. We're also gonna be demonstrating how you can create elements and all using JavaScript to build the full game interaction experience. Showing is a JavaScript word search. So word searches are fun to play and they're even more fun to build. This game section will show you how to create a fully functional word search that fills the grid with as many words as possible, all of these hidden words, and they're ready for the player to be challenged and interact with it and solve the puzzle. The grid is dynamically, automatically populated, so the player can select what size of grid they want, and the word list is brought in to the application, so this can also dynamically change, and providing the flexibility of the application to run the code generate the word search all from different word lists. So this is all possible. Player selects the size of the grid and the JavaScript logic and coding populates the word search, making a fun interactive experience for players. Last but not least, we're gonna be showing you a JavaScript, a dynamic JavaScript quiz. So this is all coming from a JSON data file. And once again, making the application dynamic. So you update the JSON data file and it's gonna update the application. So the application runs independently of the JSON data. So you can update the data and have different quizzes with different JSON files. It's also a simple way to create a quiz that's gonna run through and dynamically generate the player questions all from the JSON file. Scoring, of course, is included, debugging, tweaking the application, uh, interacting with the gameplay, and a whole lot more. We're also going to be introducing you how you can set up the HTTP protocol because AJAX is going to be needed for this section. So as you go through the lessons of the course, you're going to be amazed at how easy it is to build these projects and to create your own version of the games. So I know you're excited. Let's dive right in, start building some JavaScript games from scratch.